Time now for Back to the Basics in Healthcare with Balanced Life Chiropractic, and we have Dr. Harley. How are you? Hey, John. Doing great. Looking forward to all this nice weather. Maybe we're finally getting out of winter. This might be like the first real spring. We've had a lot of fake springs, (laughs) and then we got like real winter back. Uh, So this might be the real thing. Who knows? We'll find out. But uh, this week, we're going to talk about preventative care because a a lot of the time, people wait until they come in, they go, hey, Dr. Harley, I have this major pain, this big problem. Can you fix it? My femur's poking out of the skin, but uh, maybe, maybe they don't wait that long. <laughs> but uh, they usually come in with problems. But if, if they work on preventative care, that minimizes the problems, doesn't it? Definitely. So, yeah, if you have a broken leg, don't come to me. <laughs> Definitely go to, like, urgent care or probably the ER for that big of a bone break. Especially if the femur's poking out of the skin. Yeah, that's, de- that's an ER visit. <laughs> that's not sure. a chiropractic thing? Not at all. Yeah, so we see a lot of people for, one, reactive, which is totally fine. We definitely get there, but... You know, when you wait and wait and wait and wait and wait and wait for your problems to keep getting worse and then finally do something about it, it's going to take so much longer to work on fixing that. And it's going to not, you're not going to be the healthiest at that point because the longer you don't take care of your health, the worse it's going to continue to get. And then you're sometimes left with only a few options on how to fix it. And when people have problems and they wait to fix them, how do we typically want to fix them after we decide to do something about it? I want to fix now. Right? Everyone wants a quick fix, but yeah. the longer something's been going on, the longer it's going to take to correct it. There is no such thing as a quick fix when it comes to your health. Yeah. Our health's our greatest asset, but usually we don't do anything about it until it's gone, and then we want to get it back as soon as possible, but it just it doesn't work that way. You know, we can look at some of those kind of quick fixes, right? You know, medication. Sure, medication is going to help get rid of the symptoms, but it's not really going to correct the cause of the problem, especially not right away. And when you stop taking that medication, the problem usually comes right back. So you're usually taking that medication for a long time until you you know, start making some changes like lifestyle, diet changes, those kinds of things. And I think we've talked about that in the past. It's like turning off the, taking the batteries out of the smoke alarm rather than putting out the fire. Exactly right. Yeah. And other times, you know, problems are so bad that now you have to have surgery to correct it. Now, that's not really a quick fix because, one, it's been going on for a long time, and now you're getting to surgery. Well, depending on what it is, you might not get into surgery right away. It might take a while. And then even if you do, you got to heal. There's a long... you hope you heal right. Yeah, there's a long healing process with that surgery, let alone it's really expensive, even with your insurance covering a lot of it. You still have a very, you know, a lot of -of out-of-pocket costs to, to take on that. So really not very, you know, quick and effective in that sense of things versus if we actually take care of our health... You know, prevent these problems from getting so bad. One, you're going to be a lot happier, you're going to be a lot healthier, and you're not going to have all these problems. So we see a lot of people, one, for their corrective problems, you know, to help them with their aches and pains, but then two, to maintain their health, Mm -hmm. right? Because it's a lot easier and cheaper to maintain your health versus trying to fix it when you're left with some costly, you know, reason, costly things to fix those problems. And this is something that I can speak to because we've been over a year now coming here. And, yeah. and uh, the thing that I can tell you is I sleep better now. I feel better now. There's a lot of very positive things that, uh, that I've noticed. And I, I know that I'm not that unique. It's probably one of those <laughs> things. Where I may be a bit unique. But, but when, when, people, uh, when, when you're taking care of that, that, that kind of just makes it all better. Right. Yeah. People are, you know, as we get older, everyone's like, oh, it's just old age. Aches and pains are normal. You know, pain's never normal. It's our body's way of saying, say, hey, something's not right. And just like with our car, you can't just cover up the check engine light and it's eventually going to go away. No, the problems with your car are going to slowly get worse and be a lot more expensive to fix down the road versus, you know, taking care of your health. Yeah, you sleep much better. You handle stress much better. You're not sick as often. You know, those are all really great things with having a healthier lifestyle and chiropractic, something that can help with that. Yeah, I still cry at sad movies. Can you fix that? (laughs) No, that's not a... (laughs) Probably not. Maybe just don't watch those sad movies. Oh, there you go. That's right. Hey, if people would like to connect with you, how do they get a hold of you here at uh, Balanced Life Chiropractic? Yeah, they can shoot us a message on our Facebook page, Balanced Life Chiropractic, or give us a call at 605 215-1785. We'd love to help you and your family achieve better health goals. And you can also find them online. Their website, super simple, super easy. It's balancedlifesd.com.